All right, we got night number one under us of the Oklahoma Adventure Trail, and things are looking pretty good. We stayed in hammocks last night. Got a little chilly, um, but we made it through, and uh, and I think everybody had a good time, and we are ready to get out on the road. Got a late start last night, so um, didn't really have any video or anything that we did. We just got here, got everything set up, got to sleep, and we'll be heading out here pretty soon. Headed out to uh, the Great Salt Flats. Um, will be the first major stop that we have, and we'll get out and do a little bit more recording then. So, have a good one. We didn't get the video, but before we headed out on the road, my Jeep wouldn't start. We thought it was because the girls kept opening and closing the doors to the Jeep all night, getting cookies, getting things out. But we would find out later that it was just time for a new battery. We found this old building and we were amazed that the walls were still standing. We're guessing that it's over a hundred years old. We saw a camel on the side of the road. Who would ever guessed you'd see a camel in the middle of Oklahoma? We found our first water crossing. This one would be simple. It'd be the first of three that we would find on the Oklahoma Adventure Trail for the west half of the state. Again, this one was simple. And the next two, they'd be a little more difficult. We headed down this road only to find the bridge out. We'd have to stop and talk about how to get around it, what detour we needed to take. Just one of the things you find whenever you're driving on an old trail. We made it to Pond Creek around lunchtime and found the Peppermint Pad little burger shop that said they had the best burgers this side of the Pecos. <laughs> we had to stop and check it out and we were surprised their burgers were really really good. So we tried to go to the Great Salt Flat um, here in Oklahoma and of course um, because of my luck it's closed. So it doesn't open until April, and we're here on the, what is it, the 16th? 16th of March, so missed it by a couple weeks, um, but we're gonna push on through to the uh, Alabaster Caverns and camp there, and do a, uh, do a tour there tomorrow. So we're looking forward to it, but unfortunately it was a bust at the uh, Great Salt Flats. So 
Um, we'll have more updates here pretty soon. I think everybody's having fun. Are we having fun? <laughs> so let's uh, let's just push through, and we're gonna get there and have more updates. The end of the first day would be our longest stretch of pavement for the whole entire trip. It was amazing the further west that we went in the state of Oklahoma, how the scenery started to change. We started seeing plateaus and valleys and canyons. You don't see that too much in the central part of Oklahoma. It just made me think that I need to get out and explore my state more. You guys should do the same. Get out and explore. And remember, go all over.